For those of you who don't know me, my name is Tamia. Like and subscribe. And for my returning subscribers, thank you so much. So, in today's video, we're going to do a travel vlog. You know, it's Chinese New Year. And your girl is about to take a trip. So, you guys are coming along. Definitely, it's going to be a vibe. So, let's go. Hi guys, so I just wanted to give you all an update. Right now I'm at the railway station. My train is at 9.45 and right now it is, uh, let me check, it is 9.15. So I'm just waiting to go check in. Yeah guys, I don't know if you can guess where I'm going and you know, drop a comment, give me a hint where you think I'm going. It's definitely in China, but you know you can try to guess where i'm going <laughs> so yeah it's chinese new year by the way sing them quite uh i'm waiting for my train when i get on the train i'll talk to you guys so you know already stay tuned so guys i want to go get something to drink it's chinese new year so yeah guys it's filled like this is the worst time to travel ever everybody and their family is traveling I'm currently at the railway station trying to find some to drink. So yeah. It's so full, so loud. I don't know if you guys can hear me. But yeah, I'll see you guys when I get on the train because it's so noisy right now. I don't think you guys can hear anything that I'm saying. So, yeah, I'll see you guys. Okay, guys. I hope it's not shaking. Oh, my God. It's shaking, guys. Anyways, I cannot control it because I'm on the train. I just want to let you guys know that. Um, I don't know what I wanted to let you guys know, but... Um, <laughs> I'm on my way. Yeah, I'm on my way. The train has started moving. And I'm so sleepy, I already have my blankets and my sunglasses, so I'm about to take a nap because I woke up so early this morning. I'm very sleepy. So yeah, we'll see you guys when we get to the Airbnb. It's about one hour, 50 minutes trip. Yeah guys, vacation, Chinese New Year, you already know the vibe, get into it period <laughs> okay so later bye <laughs> waiting for my taxi to go to the airbnb so it was pretty short trip just one hour and 50 minutes about two hours and we are in shan Wei. so it's a pretty small city but you know why we came here so as you can see we are at shan Wei jan that means shan Wei railway station it's so beautiful here the weather is so good it's not cold it's just really warm and i just love it so much so we're going to be here for three days and yeah you guys gonna come along see the vibe period okay so we'll see you guys when we get to the airbnb bye <laughs>
Look at the view, you know. So guys, we are in Shanwei. Yes, Shanwei. And the reason we came here is quite obvious. I mean, there's a beach and your girl is about to catch five periods. Okay, so yeah, see you guys later. You already know. Life of Tammy, like, share, subscribe. Hi guys. <laughs> So it's so hot like we came from a cold place and it's so hot here I have no jacket nothing so we came out for lunch at this really nice restaurant at the beach but to have a vibe yeah I hope the food tastes good what's the name of the restaurant uh, it's called Z105 so yeah we're at the beach about to eat I'll show you guys what we ordered in a few so yeah let me show you guys the view it's so beautiful The beach is filled with people. Look at that beautiful sun. So hot. This is the restaurant we are at. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. so we are going back home I'm so tired I think later we will go out for dinner this is where we live our Airbnb is here so yeah the food was really good guys <laughs> I actually forgot to took a video of the food because your girl was so hungry so I took pictures though so I'll put a picture yeah we're going home see you later hey guys so I think it's 1 a.m. And we're going to have some street food, some shakao, some barbecue. So this is the meat you just take whatever meat you want. This is wings. This is pork. No, this is beef. This is beef. You can see. Chicken feet. So yeah, we're going to have some street food. It's grilled in here, actually, and they make it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yes, yes. So yeah, guys. Say some beers.
1 a.m. street food kind of vibe. Then I'm going to now show you guys how it tastes, okay? Okay, guys, so it looks so good. Our food is here. This is the chicken with all the spices. This is some baked bread. This is the beef underneath. Some potato. Some fish. It looks so good. I want to try it. So you guys can get my honest reaction. I want to try this one. So let's see. Mm. Mm. It's so good. It's well seasoned. I personally, I love chaka. But this one is a banger. Guys, what? The way they season it is so good. Anyways, I'm going to tear this up. <laughs> See you guys then. This is a bag. Guys. If one and a half and you're hungry, it's shut off. Okay, guys, so it's day two of our trip. It's currently morning time, and we're about to change our room. So, we're going to go to a hotel because there's a really nice place that we want to visit. And the hotel is pretty near, so the fit is giving, the hair is giving like period. So yeah, I'm going to take you guys along with me right now. I'm waiting for our car to go to our second hotel. Yeah, so it's been so nice. Like I really love this place, guys. It's it's so nice. I don't want to leave here, but we're still going to a beach. But I just love this place. So yeah guys, <laughs> vacation, Chinese New Year, I've been chilling, you already know. I think this is my first time you guys have seen me with my glasses right because I always wear my contacts but I actually forgot my contacts at home so glasses it is. You already know. Oh I forgot to change my earrings. <laughs> I forgot to change my earrings. Yeah I want to change my earrings actually. So yeah guys, I'll see you when we downstairs right now. We're going to the beach, you know, take some pictures, get some content for you guys. Yeah, so see you guys on the beach. Hello oh guys, Chinese New Year Parade. girl is about to go out for lunch i changed my outfit i know you saw me in the dress blah blah but let me tell you the splits on this dress was so wide 
on how I walk, like my things were showing and I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that, so I, I changed my clothes. And when I was changing my clothes, I broke my nail, guys. I broke my nail. So I just changed into this gray romper, whole suit, and my jacket on top and some sneakers. We're about to go to eat. Yesterday when we came, it was hot, sun, everything. Guys, right now, it's so cold, like, I have to wear my jacket, it's not giving very much, it's so cold, it's really foggy, foggy outside, I don't know if you can see, it's really foggy outside, but yeah, your girl is about to go to eat, I'll see you guys at the restaurant. Today I will not forget to show you guys the food. Yesterday I was <laughs> I was hungry, so I just ate and I didn't show you guys the food. But today I will not forget my babies, my family. I'm going to start calling you guys family, Tammy, like Tammy family, family. Period. I don't care if you don't like it. That's what I'm going to call you guys. So next video I'm going to say, Hey family, you better get with the vibe, okay? Period. <laughs> so yeah, second location hotel i didn't show you guys the room because it was like such a rush i just went and changed my clothes blah blah now we're about to go to eat so yeah see you guys see you guys my family i hope you are enjoying the vlog like subscribe share it's not done we still have a couple more days left you already know the vibe yeah uh, 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 uh. <laughs> um yeah see you guys see you guys see you guys okay Hey Tamily, I told you guys that's your name from now on. I'm not going to say guys, I'm going to say Tamily, okay? So we're still in the lobby for the hotel because we ordered a car to go to the restaurant, but no cars are coming, so we're just waiting. We're gonna have a little conversation with you guys, tell you guys about the city that we are in. So we're not in Guangzhou, we're not in Shanghai, we're not in Sanya, we're not in Beijing, we're not in Weizhou. I don't know most people in China have no idea where we are. So you should go and look up the city. And this is my my boyfriend. You guys have seen him on my channel, on my Instagram. His name is Eros. You can follow him on Instagram, Eros underscore WB. Yeah, that's my cameraman, guys. He's the guy behind the pictures, the footage, everything. So yeah, we are in Shanwei. Shanwei is in Guangdong province, one all away from Shenzhen. Yeah, from Shenzhen. And it has a beautiful beach, beautiful city. It's very small. So yeah, Aaron, tell us what do you think about Shanwei, the city that we're in? What do you think about it? Actually, this town is really a hidden gem in China. You know, like this place is located on the coastline, just one hour away from Shenzhen. So you just take your fast train and you are here. You know, like the and the good thing with that city is like since is very like it's not very well known there's not a lot of foreigners or even like a chinese tourist like local tourists inside of the town you know so it's really convenient you can go like to any kind of and they serve really good food because like, i think in china is like in big cities the food is mostly trash sorry because it's like harsh but like no that's that's a fact like you know they don't really care about the uh the customers or like the quality is not always well respected but here in small towns like this you go to a western restaurant the food is just giving even yesterday you just went to um a muslim restaurant where we we had some bbq guys. and guys no like let me tell you that this is like the best bbq that I've, I've eaten in china i'm telling you that's a trick guys you know so <laughs> yeah yeah but like good points is like really convenient clean safe Good food, nice spots, the beach, just perfect. Yeah. But, like on the other side, like okay, uh, the inconvenience in this city is like, since there's not a lot of people because like the town is small, there's not a lot of cars. I'm telling you like it's a hustle to find any Uber to get you from a point A to a point B. You know, you have to wait maybe like from, for 30 minutes to get a car. You know so that's like and there's no metro yeah yeah like there's no metro and like the public transportation is not that much convenient as in big cities you know like when you like you're in shenzhen in beijing if you want just to go to any place instead of the city just take like the 
you grab the bus or you grab the like the, the metro but here it's way more difficult just have to move around babies and even if you have the chance to get one you know yeah because even like the taxis because right now we are in the chinese new year like the the spring the spring festival so right now there are no like no people like instead of like most most of them they just went back to the village or for vacation but so like the city is it's basically empty so then just to find a taxi instead of the street is difficult yeah so that's my main inconvenience about the city but in overall i would give like a mark a good eight out of ten okay. yeah thank you for yeah. your opinion okay thank you family don't forget to like subscribe and comment to the channel okay stay tuned yes guys so yeah we're in shanway that's the vibe for us chinese new year um it's been really nice we haven't run into any foreigners and i personally like places like that i don't like to go places where there's a lot of foreigners and you know i don't like that i just like to be the only foreigner there just chilling on my own vibe so yeah we're just having a vibe guys we went to the beach we eat good food like yeah so if you're looking for a city to go that has a beach and you think like sanya is too far or too expensive shanway and when you go to shanway you have to beat me up and say it was tammy on youtube tammy. life of tammy that tell you about shanway okay <laughs> period so yeah guys still no car i swear it's no car <laughs> And the restaurant is like just eight minutes away, but by yeah, drive. See, I've been like waiting for like almost twenty minutes to get to Didi. This can't happen in Shenzhen. Never. <laughs> like yo. We get a car two minutes. I've already ordered like I paid already, but still no car. It's mad. Yep, guys. So yeah, we're here. But I really love the place. Like it's just so chill. Like no one bothers you. Tell you wear a mask. No one anything i mean you know china when they see foreigners they always like oh my god why go they always anywhere you go but still they don't give you any trouble so yeah guys sing and kwaila happy new year guys sing and kwaila happy chinese new year stay safe out here yeah so we'll see you guys at the restaurant hopefully we'll not be sitting here for too long we'll get a car don't forget to follow my baby on instagram <laughs> underscore eros <laughs> Eros underscore WB. I'm going to put it here. Go follow him. I know some of you guys are already looking at his page because I can put it in my Instagram, but it's whatever. I know. Don't think I don't know. I know. Okay. Anyways. <laughs> Bye, guys. See you guys. Okay, guys. So we're going to this restaurant.
family that's it for part one the video was so long so i decided to make two parts i will post it in the next few days part two will have a lot more content you'll see my interaction with chinese people the chinese new year festival and some seafood so yeah thank you for watching